Christ was a, was a righteous dude. He was he was a cool guy. You know, if you if you strip away all the kind of supernatural elements, um, I think he he had a lot of he had a lot of beautiful things to say. Even with the supernatural, that, even with the supernatural elements, he was a cool mm. guy. Um, yeah. I don't know if you've heard that song. Jesus could have turned. What does it say? <laughs> Jesus could have turned. Jesus turned water into wine. He could have turned uh, something. I'm going to misquote it. He could have turned. Uh, grass and the marijuana if he wanted to <laughs> he was a great guy and i love the miracles and i love all of it and, right. and i think if these the people who are listening to the podcast know how i feel about that but i'm sure. and i'm also sure. equal i'm also fascinated by the way that this amazing drama of satan and god gets played out you know and it, it sort of lends credence to the notion of some supernatural demonic force when you see that uh, wearing the, the this this energy in the universe, it is the energy of dissipation, corruption, debilitation. Uh, this energy uh, likes to wear the mask of its opposite and parade around as its opposite, doing the most atrocious and vile things throughout the world in the name of its enemy. It really is an incredible uh, formation that happens in the symbol structures that we call uh, organized religion, uh, and it happens in such a perfect and incredible way that to me it's it's awe inspiring and it's so spooky that here you have this religion of love, peace, empathy, uh, healing, uh, and and it gets reflected into the universe through people who are dead asleep and transformed into its opposite, and that is just amazing. And people get sucked into that tornado generations of people get sucked into an uh, this cyclone which is the reversal of the very thing they think that they are worshiping it's like it's like generations of people who think that the the the, the 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 shit at the salad bar is ice cream and they've been they've taught each other to just take <laughs> big scoops of shit and smile while they're eating and be like, ooh isn't this shit good ooh you better say it's good or you're going to go to hell don't you love it mm, it's delicious that's what it is when right there at that very salad bar on the other side if you go to the root of what the, most of these religions are it's just the sweetest most delightful delicious sustaining thing ever but you never get to that side of the salad bar because it's being guarded by men and women dressed like penguins <laughs>